you guys, my name is Skyler. So one of my biggest regret in life is that I didn't vlog enough in high school because high school is one of the happiest years for me. I mean, the reason why I love filming and editing videos is because for me, photography and videography, they both capture the moment. They both represent memories. But when it comes to videography, they document the lives in a more vivid and literal way. Like you could just click on play and the moment would just relive once again before your eyes. I remember when I was in freshman year, smartphones are still not a thing. We used light phones and flip phones, like the old days. And going on to second year, smartphones started prosper, so everybody is using iPhone, Sony, like basically all the smartphone companies you've ever heard of. Smartphones start becoming a thing, and the camera attached to the smartphone like improved over the days. It makes it easier for us to take pictures and take videos. Why did this struck me hard? Because I was just going to my hard drive last night. I took a lot of photos. I'm sure of that. Looking at those photos, I sometimes would just I don't know. I just desperately hope that I took a video at that moment instead of snapping a picture because a picture is just that <laughs> but a video is like that <laughs> so in this video i decided to show you the craziness in my high school and to have you guys walk down memory lane with me and i hope you guys could find them entertaining so yeah let's go okay so first things first our school we have the school dance that everyone needs to learn in their second year one time when we were having our school fair we basically decided to flash mob this dance in the middle of the basketball court we just rang up everyone we knew and we told them okay 1 30 basketball court shakira and that's what we did Next up, we have this graduation trip in our third year of high school. Yeah, we have three years, not four years. And basically, every class has to come up with a performance to perform at night. And our class, well, I think we did a pretty amazing job. <laughs> Our English teacher is an amazing person and every year on Christmas he would just wear a Christmas hat and come in class and be like ho 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 I'm gonna give you guys candy because I'm a good teacher no 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 he didn't say that last part but he's very cute he always makes Christmas extra special for us and this is what happened on Christmas the third year of our high school there's only three weeks until our huge college entrance exam so everybody's under pressure and our teacher would just be like okay have some candy you guys are gonna do just fine <laughs> happened in our class there's this one time when two of my friends they just bought a small carton of um <laughs> they just bought a small carton of beverages and they decided to race and see who drinks the fastest and this is what happened <laughs> <laughs> you know how in my high school video I told you guys I acquired the skill to change in class You saw me do it without revealing my own flesh And one time during nap time in our class I filmed one of my friends doing the exact same thing Okay, so back in high school, I was actually a pretty typical nerd. I studied because I feel like uh, as a student, I need to get good grades, get into good college, yeah, Asian brain. Anyways, in the last few months of my high school years, I started to realize that you have to balance out your studies and your leisure life. I decided to hang out with my friends more and do stupid things with them more. And one time we just created this dance battle club and we pretended like we we're the 99th dance battle club and we we're recruiting and we filmed a trailer for it. We came up with food nicknames for each of us and me, being an amazing actor. Of course, when it comes to filming a trailer, I nailed it. <laughs> my friends a lot. I like to video bomb, photo bomb them. Here's one clip of me video bombing one of my friends. <laughs> Okay, 
the one thing I have to mention is that our class loves to sing and basically every time we got a chance to sing we would do it maybe there are people who don't know the lyrics we would write the lyrics on the blackboard and we would just stand up and sing even when the teacher is in the classroom or sometimes maybe we'll sing to invite the teacher into our classroom that's something very special about our class it was Christmas my second year of high school and we have this girl who's very good at playing the guitar and she wrote a song so during Christmas in English class we have on our Christmas hats and we started singing along to our friend's song and we kind of changed the lyrics a bit but we sang <laughs> And this clip, it's our graduation trip. We were on this boat doing nothing. And my friends just decided to sing on the boat, sing to the sea. And I just filmed them. And it was it was a good time. clip was from right after our graduation and basically it's a bit drizzling so the track is wet and my friend decided to film me singing kind of in the rain yeah okay okay enough with the horrible singing clips our class is very very talented we have people who draw we have people who sing and this particular clip those who got accepted into college earlier they just organized this performance here's a small clip of this girl singing <laughs> can get pretty crazy at times but we are very sweet uh, we were very lucky to have this homeroom teacher that genuinely cares about us it was her birthday and we decided to surprise her with a cake and we decided to sing this song to her the lyrics is like we love you thank you so much and yeah we sang to her and I personally find this clip pretty sweet we are very grateful to have her as our homeroom teacher and this is how we choose to express our gratitude <laughs> Okay, I'm not sure about schools abroad, but if you've seen any Taiwanese or Chinese movie, you would notice that there is always a military instructor in our school. That day is Teacher's Day, and when the instructor came in our classroom, we just sang to him because why not? <laughs> Taiwan, every high school, we have our own students compose a graduation song and in the end we would vote and pick out the one we want. Our class, someone wrote a graduation song. She was filming this music video for her song and there was this clip where it requires all of us to sing. We learned the lyrics and the melody in like one or two hours so our class is pretty talented when it comes to singing. <laughs> Every school has it. Normally, we have to sing it on the assembly every Thursday. And trust me, the volume isn't always the highest, but on graduation, we sang it like pretty out loud. Here's a small clip. <laughs> has its own national anthem. To be honest, I'm not a fan. I'm not the only one. Not all of us are big fans of our national anthem because it's really not that good for the ears, at least for me. But same, there are some occasions that we would just sing it extremely out loud. This is a clip of us singing the national anthem so very loudly on the last day of school. <laughs> all the 
interesting clips I found on my hard drive. I mean, there are still a lot, but I decided to narrow down and find the essential ones that represented my high school years. High school is a pretty precious moment of my life. I would cherish it with all my heart. Like just watching the videos makes me extremely emo, but I'll get over it because I'm a strong girl and I get over things pretty swiftly. <laughs> That's about it, I think. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe in case you still haven't. And click on that bell button if you want to get notified every time I upload a new video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in another new video. Until next time, bye! Oh.